Hi, this is Dave from Baltimore Meadows, and today I'm going to show you a video guide of how to use our new bacteria and water E. coli test kit. The first step is to take a small sample of water and set it aside for two minutes. After we've waited two minutes for our water sample, we'll take our bottle of lysate and our reaction tube, add three drops. Take our pipette, suction up a little from our sample. We're going to add 0.1 milliliters to the reaction tube. This will get us roughly to 0.5 milliliters, which is indicated on the reaction tube. Then we seal it up and we shake well. Then we add our reagent strip, which is in our sealed foil and add it to our mixture. Then we wait 10 minutes. Okay, it's been 10 minutes, and now we're gonna identify whether we have E. coli in our drinking water or not. When we remove the test strip, we can see that it's actually still white, which indicates that it's negative for E. coli or bacteria. If there's any tint of blue, we wanna keep the test strip in the water for an extra hour then we'll be able to identify the actual level of contaminant compared to the color chart on our box.